Last time we saw our first wood duck hen enter the box. Meet Agatha. She will become our lead actress of the Middle Box Show. Meet Shabby. Will he be the comedic relief or the villain of the show? We'll find out later. Here we see Doris, supporting actress extraordinaire and queen of the side Look. box. Look. Wood duck hens generally lay one egg per day until they've reached a full clutch, which can vary from 6 to 16 <laughs> eggs. As we monitored our leading ladies, we noticed that they have a pretty regular pattern for what time they enter the boxes each day. Once they enter the box, they rearrange the wood chips until they are comfortable. It looks strange, but it must make sense to them. Here, Doris breaks the number one rule of immersion in filmmaking and looks directly at the camera. As they finish laying the egg, they meticulously cover it and then depart for a day of dabbling and flying around. You know, doing duck stuff. Thanks to her burying, we can't see any eggs just yet. These Canada geese are displaying their courting ritual. We'll spare you the PG-13 version. On the morning of March 28th, Doris was attempting to enter the box when a new character violently stole the show. Meet our Eastern Bluebirds.
Being a star is tiring for old Doris, but it seems another hen wanted the show to go on. The next day, as Doris left the nest again, she left behind a surprise as well. Not even joking, a flock of ten, mostly drakes, just landed. It is nine drakes and one female. This is the craziest thing I've ever seen. And there they go. You might think this clip is frozen, but if you look carefully, our great blue heron friend is just standing like a statue as he hunts. As the days progress, you can see our egg count rising. The eastern bluebirds are here again and they seem to be jealous of Doris's nest. This went on for a few days until we bought them off by building them a house of their own. Greedy things. On the night of April 11th, Agatha slept in the box. This is the first time we've witnessed a night hen. We presume that this is the beginning of the brooding process, which we dubbed the preheat. During this time, she began staying overnight, but still leaving early in the morning. The full brood was just around the corner. Damn, look at them gams. On April 13th, Doris started her preheat cycle. Typically, the brooding process lasts anywhere from 28 to 32 days before the eggs hatch. On the morning of April 18th, Agatha's brood was disrupted by a dump nester. Wood duck hens, especially the younger ones, sometimes lay their eggs in other hens' brooding areas. This hen seems so desperate that it landed on top of Agatha and then proceeded to lay her egg despite Agatha fighting back against her.
the hen did successfully lay her egg, and after some confusion, Agatha just covered it and continued incubating. The action did not stop over the course of the night. Early on April 19th, Shabby the Raccoon made his encore appearance. Doris flew out of the nest without even taking the time to bury her eggs. The question now was if she would return after such a harrowing ordeal. Up next should be the hatch and jump day. Stay tuned for more DuckTales. Woo! If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe.